In a world where trends come and go with the swipe of a screen, a new player has entered the arena, capturing the attention of the youth and raising eyebrows among the unaware. This is the story of Zin, the nicotine pouch that's more than just a fad, it's a phenomenon. Zin, a seemingly innocuous tin of white rectangles, is the latest jewel in the crown of a tobacco empire. Designed to be discreetly tucked under the lip, these nicotine pouches are causing a stir. With strengths up to 6 milligrams, they've been known to knock first-timers off their feet, literally. Despite being marketed as a healthier alternative to smoking, experts like Robert Jackler warn of their addictive nature, and dentists are already seeing the damage. But how did Zinn sneak into the lives of so many teens? The answer lies in the algorithmic underworld of social media. Platforms like TikTok have become the new street corners, where products like Zen find their way into the daily scrolls of unsuspecting users. Grayson IMM, a high school student, witnessed the rise of Zen content on his feed, signaling a trend that's hard to ignore. Influencers, the new age cool kids, are at the heart of this digital marketing revolution. Their posts, a blend of personal anecdotes and product placements, resonate with the youth, creating a bond that traditional advertising could never achieve. And with social media algorithms at their disposal, their influence is amplified to unprecedented levels. Enter the Zinfluencers like Tucker Carlson who've taken to the internet to profess their love for Zin. Despite denials from Philip Morris International, the parent company of Zinn, about partnerships with influencers, the impact is undeniable. Videos like the Nelk Boys helicopter stunt with Carlson have gone viral, reaching millions. This new wave of marketing slips through the cracks of a regulatory system playing catch-up. The internet has changed the game, and the rules are yet to be rewritten. While platforms like YouTube have taken steps to restrict underage access to such content, the sheer volume of influencer-driven promotion makes policing a Herculean task. The rise of Zen and its social media conquest is a wake-up call. It's a reminder that the digital world our children navigate is fraught with hidden persuaders, pushing products that are as addictive as they are accessible. As we grapple with the implications, one thing is clear. The influence of social media is not just shaping trends, it's shaping futures. Don't forget to show your support by giving the video a thumbs up and subscribing to the International Lens for the latest updates. Stay tuned for more informative content.